Chet TV studios in British Columbia. This is Chet TV News with Marlon Gomez. Hello and welcome to Chet TV News. I'm Marlon Gomez. We begin here in Chetwin. Don Titus Elementary School rallied up their grade two, three, and four students for a cause which will change the lives of people in Ethiopia. Have a look. For many of us here in Canada, access to drinking water is fairly simple and requires very little effort. Sadly, that's not the case in parts of Ethiopia. Don Titus Elementary School teacher Brenda Key went to a summer camp this past year in Ethiopia, and she says due to a broken well, people have to embark on a journey just to get some water. Some of the people walked two days to get to the water source, um, and it took about takes about 20 minutes because it's just gravity-fed pipes. It takes about 20 minutes to fill a jerry can, and they were only allowed two jerry cans each. Yeah, and then they would take two days to get back, and then one day rest, and then they'd do it all over again. And so, the group that organizes these summer camps is working hard to raise money in order to repair the well. Knowing just how valuable this well could be for the community, Ms. Key decided to turn to her students for help. We're going to be walking to the fire um, house, and we're going to be walking back here and carrying the water we need to use in a day as a representative of what Ethiopia people have to do. Students laced up their boots and for the next hour they hauled as much water as they could carry. Well, people could sponsor them for a flat rate or they could sponsor the kids per liter. So there, we have a tally going on so the kids are going to go back and forth to the school yeah. and then however many liters they brought will send it home with their pledge sheet. So if somebody sponsored them for a dollar a liter and they hauled 10 liters, then they would get $10. So it's kind of a motivator for the kids to keep going even when it gets a little bit hard. But it wasn't all just about the hard work. Underneath all those gallons of water, Ms. Key made sure a few lessons would surface. Maybe help the kids uh, realize how much we take it for granted. You know, we've, we've done graphs and figured out how much water we use in a day. So now we're going to look at how much we hauled and how that compares to how much we actually use in a day. And the kids kind of realize that, yeah, water is something that we do take for granted. As of today, Ms. Key and their students raised just over $1,900, and she says more donations are still coming in. Well done, guys. Chet TV is owned and operated by the Chetwin Communication Society. You can find us on Channel 655 on Bell, East Link Channel 40, or on Air Channel 55. Chet TV, your station.